ladies and gentlemen, presenting the 2020 Celine High School Marching Band. Over the past six months, we have heard a lot about space. The exciting first man SpaceX launch from Cape Canaveral in May, the amazing summer vision of Comet Neowise hanging below the Big Dipper, and another way of thinking about space, six feet of space, exactly. We have taken on this challenge as a marching band and have prepared a show where every band member maintains a distance of greater than six feet of space. Although we have to stay a little farther apart than usual, the music will fill that space and connect us all. We open with drum major Cora Hart on the podium in our upbeat version of Also Sprock, Zarathustra, made famous in the film 2001, A Space Odyssey. Sinatra's versions of this song were famous in the 1960s while the Apollo missions to the moon captured the nation's attention. Please welcome drum major Elena Dorset to the podium to lead the band in this bossa nova and swing standard. for a space show theme, but it's a great tune and we like to play it, so who cares? There's a very subtle connection though. Listen carefully and see if you can pick it up. Here is Shut Up and Dance by the Ohio Rock Band. Wait for it. Walk the Moon! Thank you. 
Ladies and gentlemen, the Swing High School Matching Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the 2020 Celine High School Homecoming Celebration. The Celine Area Schools family is proud of its heritage and is thrilled to present this homecoming celebration based on those traditions. Thank you to the Celine community for participating in our homecoming events this week and contributing their photos. Many of the Celine Area School students in K through 12 contributed to the Spirit Days this week. Please visit the SHS Student Council Facebook page or Twitter for spirit photos and shoebox float photos. We'd like to thank the Celine High School Marching Band under the direction of Mr. Nate Lampman, Ben Reed, and Scott Cannell, and featuring drum majors Alana Dorsett and Cora Hart. Thank you for providing the special backdrop for tonight's crowning. A special thank you also goes to Principal David Raft, Principal Dr. Ryan Rowe, Assistant Principals Joe Pelka, Teresa Steger, and Kirk Evanson, Athletic Director Andrew Parrish, Dean of Students, Patty Fosdick, Custodians, Security Team, Secretaries, IT Department, and all of the other support staff at Saline High School. Thank you also goes out to our class advisors, the freshman advisors, Brandon Smith and Gina Panzica, our sophomore advisors, Holly Neve and Audra Lucas, our junior advisors, Mike Hill and Jason Schmier, and our senior advisors, Sarah Stuckey and Melanie Scott. Finally, the biggest thanks goes to our student council advisors, Lori Dawson and Alyssa Dawson, along with the student council members who have kept our homecoming school spirit alive this week. Fans, please join me in saying thank you by giving a much deserved round of applause. And now the 2020 homecoming court has assembled on the field. The court comprises of representatives from each class nominated by their peers. The homecoming king and queen were selected by the entire student body through voting this week. All of these students are honored tonight for their school spirit, friendliness, enthusiasm, and participation at school. Representing the freshman class of 2024 are Grace Warren and Connor Mitzel. Grace is a freshman at SHS. She's the daughter of Steve and Amanda Warren. Grace has three younger sisters, Charlotte, Lily, and Stella, and Grace plays travel soccer for Michigan Tigers and just finished her first season with the Celine Girls JV Golf Team. Connor Mitzel. Connor is the son of Kevin and Angie Mitzel. He plays varsity soccer and is the treasurer of class of 2024. Connor also enjoys playing basketball, football, and fantasy football. He spends free time with his friends, his puppy, socializing and listening to music. Congratulations to Grace and Connor. <laughs> Representing the sophomore class of 2023 are Carson Caldwell and Andrew Height. Carson is being escorted by her mom, Anju Taylor. Carson is a sophomore at Celine High School and is the president of the class of 2023. In her free time, she plays soccer and loves to spend time with her family and friends. Andrew's parents are Thomas and Angela Height. Andrew enjoys making music while playing trumpet in the marching band and singing with the chordsmen. He spends his free time arranging duets with his brother and gaming with the boys. Congratulations to Carson and Andrew. <laughs> Representing the junior class of 2022 are Abigail Dooley and Wyatt Soa. Abigail's parents are Greg and Jessica Dooley. She is a junior at Celine High School. 
and Abigail is involved with many clubs, some being Key Club, FCCLA, and Mission Earth. In her free time, she enjoys going outside and spending time with her friends. Wyatt's parents are Andrew and Christine Soa, and Wyatt is a member of the marching band and plays the saxophone. Congratulations to Abigail and Wyatt. And now it's time to introduce the homecoming court for the senior class of 2021. First, Libby Hansen. Libby is escorted today by her parents, Dale and Valerie Hansen. She is always busy either hanging out with friends, going shopping, or playing soccer. Libby has been playing soccer for nine years now and is excited about her final season. She is involved with SAD and NHS and loves getting a chance to volunteer in her free time. Lastly, she wants to thank everyone for the opportunity to be nominated for Homecoming Court. Next, we have Ben Baskowski. Ben is being escorted by his parents, Victor and Shelley Baskowski. Ben is an outstanding student and goes above and beyond what is expected. He participates in many activities such as DECA, BPA, and Link Crew. Outside of school, Ben works at a local coffee shop. Loves to camp on the weekends with his family and friends, and in the winter he hits the slopes to go downhill skiing. Next we have Ava Ignacio. <laughs> Ava's parents are Edward and Christine, and she is the eldest child of four. She is honored to be here today. Ava is captain of the girls cross country team, clarinet section leader of our marching band, vice president of Generation Global, captain of her parish youth program, a link leader, and is a member of the National Honor Society. Ava plans to study statistics in college to pursue her love of data analysis. Next, we have Caesar Figueres. Caesar is being escorted by his parents, Caesar and Eileen Figueres. He has been an active member of the community through his many involvements in extracurriculars such as Science Olympiad, marching band, cross country, ethics, and many more. Caesar has made a positive impact on SHS by being an alto saxophone section leader and a member of the leadership council on the Science Olympiad team. Next, Gianna Lepore. Gianna's parents are Greg and Amy Lepore. Gianna is involved in many clubs, including SAD, Link Crew, and National Honor Society. She has been dancing for almost 14 years now and is currently captain of the SAS Varsity Dance Team. In her spare time, she enjoys hanging out with her friends and family and developing her skills in graphic design, a career she hopes to pursue. Gianna wants to thank everyone for, her, for giving her this amazing opportunity to be on the homecoming court. Jason Heisler. Jason's parents are Doug and Jennifer Heisler. Jason is involved in varsity soccer, swim and dive, as well as NHS, SAD, and yearbook. He has two brothers, Adam and Zachary. Jason was a gymnast for eight years and hopes to either play soccer or dive in college while pursuing a career in public relations and convergent media. Jason wants to thank everyone for this great experience. Zoe Zambovic. Zoe's parents are Tom and Liz Zambovic. Zoe en enjoys hanging out with friends and playing sports. She is in student council, ethics, and DECA. Zoe loves eating crepes and traveling with her family. She also goes to, she hopes to go to a big state university and major in information systems. Next we have Noah Sosha. Noah's parents are James and Michelle Sosha. Noah is extremely grateful for this opportunity and would like to thank his classmates for their support. Noah is involved in many activities, including cross country, marching band, and student council. He sits at the, as the student representative to the Celine Board of Education and also volunteers at his church on the weekends by playing piano and helping with youth group. Noah has not yet chosen a college, but plans to pursue a major in political science. Congratulations to Libby, Ben, Ava, Caesar, Gianna, Jason, Zoe, and Noah. Crowning our king and queen tonight is our student council's executive council co-president, 
Aditya Arora, and senior class president and the 2020 Miss Celine, Shayoni Bandiopadie. And now, with no further ado, we would like to congratulate our 2020 homecoming king and queen, Jason Heisler and Ava Ignacio. Congratulations to all students for showing your Hornet pride during homecoming week. Thank you and enjoy the rest of the game.